Jeff the Plumber from the Plumber's Truck. You may have seen me out there in public, but many people ask me, and they're confused, um, on the back of my shirt or on the front of my shirt, it'll say Chaplain Jeff the Plumber. Um, what does that mean? That seems like an oxymoron. You're a plumber and a chaplain. I don't understand that. So, um, yes, uh, something that... Uh, that I've done in the last five years. I went to school, several schools, um, to become a chaplain and keep, I keep going, continuing education when classes come up that I think will help me. What is so a chaplain? To become a better chaplain. Um, and, and I only say this because, uh, people are like, well, why? Well, I'm like, well, I believe in God, but also I believe in being good to people. I believe in being good and doing good deeds. So, um, what does that mean? And I'm like, well, there are tools I like to have in my toolbox, like I have in my truck, that uh, the more tools you got, the more stuff you can do. And why not have more tools in my personal tool belt to make me better in an all-around person? And the chaplain stuff has done that for me. Um, obviously, um, initially, when I finished it, and I had some great losses in my family. The chaplain stuff helped me deal with those losses, but also help others when I'm out there who are dealing with losses because that's what chaplains do. Um, there was a short time where I was a law enforcement chaplain, and, uh, and I realized I couldn't do it because um, it was just too hard to go to someone's house and tell them someone died um, when I am personally still mourning myself from many losses in my own life. And... The chaplain stuff maybe eventually would become uh, a job career thing um, when I'm no longer the plumber. So I'm always just thinking ahead. But that's what it means. Chaplains uh, believe uh, not our one religion kind of thing. Although I am believe in Christianity and Jesus. Um, in my chaplain training I have learned about other religions. And really what a chaplain does is talk to you with God's love, and when I say God's love, whoever God you may believe in, even if it's not the same God as I, um, and help you to navigate the scenario of the feelings that you're feeling in a time when you're down and maybe your thoughts and mind are dark and you need some light in your life, that's when the chaplain can come in and hopefully help you or give you the tools or the phone numbers or the assistant to lead you in the right direction to kind of help you. So that's what it means. So when I'm in your house and I'm your plumber, I could also help you if you want to talk about anything personal. It's fine um, because like a priest or a pastor or a chaplain, uh, whatever you tell us stays with us. The only other person between you, I, and God, that's it. And that's where it stays. Um, so we, you can come to us and confess to us. Unless, of course, it's a crime. And then, of course, there's a whole other set of rules where we'll have to report it. Um, but but that's not not the, the just of it. It's to help you through um, times where the darkness is greater than the light. And uh, I would help you and talk to you if you need me, Jeff the Plumber, uh, the chaplain, Jeff the Plumber, to come and chat with you. So that's what it is. Jeff the Plumber from the Plumber's Truck. Peace and love, everyone. Peace and love. Have a great day.